Hey guys, Wade Bosch Iverson here. I've got a ton of mail for you guys, as you can tell up there. Um, plus I got a few that I got in over the last few days that I opened already. Um, and I guess, quick announcement, tomorrow I have a four by f or four team relay race, 50, 55 miles, um, and I will be running one fourth of that. Uh, so this is pretty much the first time I've been able to compete in yeah, about the last five or six months. Um, so I'm I'm really excited for this. Uh, you know, I really, really trained hard for this. Um, changed my body style. Uh, I used to be kind of a football player, built type of guy. Uh, I played football for a little bit. Um, but I thinned out, and I'm still working on getting a little bit thinner um, because you got to be wiry to run, um, which I'm still working on. But... Anyway, we will start with the mail. First of all, what I've already gotten in, Chris Bosch, Superscripts autograph from 0708 SPX. A beautiful on Letterman, or Letterman autograph from Topps Letterman, 0708 as well. I have a few of these, numbered 64 out of 75. Gorgeous, gorgeous card. Then I have a really, really nice, these are hard to come by, uh, from SP Game Used. 0304 Chris Bosch rookie autograph numbered 17 out of 100 from uh, rookie exclusives autograph. These book 140, I believe. That particular card um, got a pretty good price. Then this is a really cool card. Also rookie year 0304 size tag patch. Beautiful card, auto classics, and that's numbered to four. So beautiful rookie patch. Then I have a trade. This is, oops, why am I showing the camera that? From Gronk Fan. He says, Nick, thanks for the trade. I'm glad to be collecting basketball again. It's always great chatting with you. Keep up the great collection, Mike Rizzo. Apparently I sent him a damage card, so I'm going to send him something out. Um, uh, we'll talk about that, but I really do apologize. I, if I noticed it was damaged before, I would have stopped it, but um, I didn't. Anyway, Felix Hernandez, and I'm real excited to get this card in. Thank you for sending in a magnetic. A beautiful Felix Hernandez Tops Tier 1 autograph, numbered 76 of 99. Just a gorgeous, clean design from Tops Tier 1. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Now I'm also going to do a quick recap I did. Uh, today I had to go buy some of these boxes uh, for my collection uh, that fit top loaders because the boxes I have currently don't really fit top loaders. Um, so I got a bunch of stuff. Got a bunch of cards there. Um, it's kind of a mess now. Let's see if I can fish them all out. But anyway, when I got there, I did uh, four packs of Topps Archives 2012 Baseball, and I also did uh, two packs of Bowman Jumbo. Uh, really, really fun, fun break. Um, that's one of the things that I really, really love about uh, the Topps products this year, is they're really fun products to break. Um, and I really, I had a good time breaking them, really. Uh, let's see, those are my main cards. So first of all, I wanted to show you quick Topps Archives. Um, you guys know I don't break a lot of baseball. In fact, I don't break any baseball, really. Um, but I love Topps Archives. They take old school designs. So like this is one of the older school designs. But they're all from the past, like 1986, 1950s. Um, so you have all various different types and designs that Topps has done over the years. They do it with current players, and they also do it with older players, like Yogi Berra. Jose Valverde, Clay Buckholz. Um, let's see, those are some base, like that. But it's just a really fun break. Um, and I, I would really advise you to pick some up if you know a little bit about baseball. Uh, if you don't do any baseball, obviously don't. But uh, Oh, and then they have some fun inserts like Carl Yastrzemski uh, sticker. Um, let's see, they have this as an insert, Topps Archives. This is a cloth. Uh, card of Roy Holiday. It's a little easier to see, um, but kind of cool inserts. And let's see, where is the main hits I got from that? There's a few more base. 
Okay, and so these were, uh, so I got the Roy Holiday class sticker. Then this was a short print. They do a whole bunch of different short prints. Uh, Monte Irving Tops Archives insert. It's not necessarily numbered, um, but you can go online and you can check. Uh, some of these are really, really rare. I also was lucky enough to hit one of the autographs of the box, um, which are absolutely gorgeous. I love them to death. Um, they have a really unique checklist, and uh, here's the guy I got. Yeah, the camera's not showing really well. Buddy Bell autograph from the Rangers. Incredibly great player, third base for the Rangers. Hit pretty darn well um, for the Rangers. And so this was done in the, I believe, 1981 top style. Not 100% sure of that. And then there's the COA basically is up there, that stamp mark. Um, I think it's a really cool way to do it. And I really love this uh, product. I would definitely advise you to check it out. Um, then I also did two packs of the Bowman Jumbo. Give you an idea what Bowman Jumbo is like. There's a whole mix of different cards in there. Um, so for example, here's kind of what the for basic first Bowman card base. These are all rookies. Uh, then you have the Bowman Chrome base. These are all Bowman Chrome rookies. First Bowman cards. Uh, this is a rookie card of Alex Liddy, who's playing in the majors this year. A um, whole bunch of rookies. Then they have inserts like this Gary Brown, Bowman's Best insert. Uh, they look real cool. Uh, then you have Gold's inserts like that. More of the first Bowman Chrome. Um, all sorts of different cards. It's kind of like 18 products rolled into one, um, to be honest. And let's see if I can give you guys some of the hits from that. I actually was able to get an autograph from this as well. Um, so here's like a first Bowman card. Really cool looking sparkle. Make it dance. Noah Perro. Uh, then I was able to get a Francisco Lindor rookie card. Bowman Chrome. Let's save that, save that, save that. All right, a Bryce Harper rookie card, Bowman Chrome. Really, really cool. A U Darvish rookie. This is only in two packs, by the way. I did really, really well. And a Garrett Cole rookie card, Bowman Chrome rookie. So I was able to hit Darvish, Garrett Cole, Bryce Harper, uh, and Francisco Lindor. And then I also hit an autograph, a beautiful on-card autograph of Brandon Jacobs. And these autographs just look really, really impressive. There's the pack. Uh, but it was a really fun break. Um, pretty cheap break, too. Uh, it's not too expensive. Uh, obviously, Bowman Jumbo is, but like Tops, Tops Archives, you can get for around 90 bucks a box, 100 bucks a box. Uh, you get two on card autographs, and then you get a whole bunch of really cool looking cards. Um, I'm considering doing the base set from that. It's just such a beautiful set. Uh, anyway, guys, I'm going to break this up and do a second video with my mail, my actual mail, um, because that was a nine-minute video. <laughs> Anyways, thanks to Gronk fan, Gronk fan, and I will we'll work something out with that. Um, some pretty cool cards and two really cool products. Appreciate it, guys.